I wonder too, Kara, if you know remote learning will need to be an option again, even though we take a look at, at you know some of the recent numbers and see that school wasn't a major source of the spread. I really hope that remote learning is the absolute last resort. We know that kids learn best in school. We know that it's best for their social emotional well being as well. And the the ripple effects that ha that this has on families and communities, right? The best place for kids is in schools. So I think we really have to pay close attention to the local numbers and really um, not prematurely move in that direction. And it's interesting, one viewer wrote in to say, bring back distance learning for families who wish for it. Not all kids suffered, some thrived. And Nick, was that your experience that some kids did well and, and others didn't? It, it was some some kids thrived in the environment at the same time uh the situation was a lot of the accountability was on the student it's those students who who need us to kind of give them their pep talks who you can be in their presence of i i absolutely think and to agree with Kara, that virtual learning should be the last option as educators there's no replacement for in-person learning uh even though students may have thrived academically and the one thing I reminded myself a lot this year of, just because a student's doing well academically does not mean that they're doing well, mm -hmm. because emotionally, as far as self-care, you know, just because they're getting it A, virtual, does not mean that they're emotionally stable. And that's one thing I kept reminding myself as an educator. But it should be a last resort. It, it, it is not, again, it is not a substitute. It is not an equal to in-person learning. But at the same time, the fact educators are willing to work harder and do and put more time to that should tell you that we're more concerned about your child's safety than we're about our the workload we're willing to do more work just to ensure that there's some stability or structure or consistency because going back and forth is is not fair to it's not fair to students it's not fair to parents and it's not fair to teachers